Hello, uh, I'm Dr. Sirisha Kusuma. I'm a pediatric endocrinologist uh, working in Hyderabad. Uh, today we have a question. Um, do children get diabetes and is it same as the same uh, diabetes that happens in adults? Uh, yes, children do get diabetes, uh, but it's not the same, uh, it's not usually the same as seen in adults. Uh, what is diabetes? Uh, let us just see what is diabetes first. It's a chronic condition where the blood sugar levels go high. There is a hormone in our body called insulin which is produced by the pancreas that is responsible for keeping the blood sugar levels under control. Just like a car needs petrol to run, our body needs sugar which is also known as glucose as its energy source. Whenever we eat, the food that we eat gets broken down into simple sugar called glucose and this glucose gets released into the bloodstream. So the insulin that is present in the bloodstream opens the doors of the cells so that the glucose will enter the cells and gives them energy. At the same time, the levels in the blood will come down. So what happens here is that um, sometimes the insulin production from the pancreas comes down. Um, pancreas sometimes decreases the production of insulin and eventually stops producing insulin. So this happens in a situation called type 1 diabetes. This happens because the immune system in the body uh, tries to destroy the insulin producing cells in the pancreas. We don't know the exact reason why it happens but there are lots of genetic reasons and viral uh, etiology behind it. So um, ultimately the result is that the insulin production gradually comes down and eventually completely stops. This is called type 1 diabetes. This is used to be called juvenile diabetes because this is uh, commonly seen um, in young adults and children. Uh, it is also known, known as insulin dependent diabetes because these children need insulin for their survival throughout their life. When you take type 2 diabetes, the situation is a bit different because the pancreas produces insulin but that insulin, the body is not able to use that insulin because there is a certain insulin resistance at the cellular level. This is usually seen in adults. So type 1 diabetes is seen in children, type 2 diabetes is usually seen in adults. In type 2 diabetes, uh, we can control the sugar levels by doing some lifestyle modifications like adjusting their diet, shifting to healthy diet and increasing the physical activity levels and sometimes oral medications, all of which will increase the insulin sensitivity. Very occasionally they do need um, externally administered insulin. So the essential points here to remember is that in type 1 diabetes we do not have insulin so the child needs um, insulin for survival throughout life externally administered insulin whereas in type 2 diabetes we do not always need insulin because we have insulin but we are not able to use it. So just by some diet and exercise and oral medications we can keep the sugars under control.